Hello guys, welcome back to Stalker Call of Pripyat. And today we're going to check out what the fuck's going on here. I'm supposed to bring these guys veils detectors. Actually, I should probably not have my weapon out. Cuz I think there's I think there's sciency people. Oh, hey. I'm Hey, I have a couple questions. Are you talking about the people who live in the bunker? Uh, yeah, it's some group. Two scientists. Herman, the top dog here, and... Uh, oh, something Sky. They employ Nikolov, or whatever the fuck, who handles the technical stuff, and Gary's their guide. Then there's us. They recruited us recently to take measurements and other science stuff. Oh, and Gary brought some army dude into the bunker the other day. That's about it. Alright. Talking about the army guy. Uh, Gary met him as he's running away from zombies. He's lucky it was Gary, too, because most others would have taken him out for sure. Uh, he doesn't leave the bunker anymore, so I don't blame him. Alright. Um, can you tell me about this area? Uh, there's an old military base not far from here. Uh, there's also a train on a rail road near Brad, and it's not a fun place. Okay. I, d I don't really care about any of this, actually. So, I have nothing for you. Hey, bro! But we can go inside. You must wait for the dock to come all right. What? So, welcome to a new place that we have here. Nothing over here, I guess. So, we have a couple of people here that we need to introduce ourselves to. Hello! Hello! Uh, what kind of modifications can you perform? So, he can do repairs, but I don't think he can do modifications. No. I'm actually pretty sure he can't. Alright, uh, what equipment modifications can you perform? There's no, uh, there's no Kevlar weapons, uh, for spare parts here. What can you do is patch up body armor, modify, using one of my personal developments. As you can imagine, I got plenty of top notch, uh, top notch equipment to spare. Alright, well, that's it. Tell me about your bunker. What do you want to know? I actually don't want to know anything. What are the marks doing here? Getting my way, but my personal opinion. They're just guarding him. Okay, so he's got really nothing for me here. Bye. He, so he does, like, a couple of upgrades and shit like that. Howdy, Howdy, bro. So here's a stalker, and I think this is the military guy. Where did you get a military uniform? Uh, well, I guess everyone knows that the military uh, helicopter's crash, but I'm Lieutenant Skolkloff, co-pilot one of the helicopters. Hey, it's one of the guys in the crashed helicopters that we're here for. How did you end up here? He crashed into Jupiter workshop and went through the roof. I'm the only survivor. I managed to get out of the Jupiter plant and ma make my way to the nearest evacuation point, but nobody was there. I then met Gary and he led me to the bunker. Alright. Uh, which point did you go to? Sorry, I can't discuss that. It's classified. What did you do here? Uh, my orders are to proceed to the evacuation point, but the zone is too dangerous. I'm a pilot, not a stormtrooper. That's why I'm waiting here in hopes that I'll be collected by the time the operation is completed. Okay, apparently I'm not going to let him know that I'm here for him, but whatever. Uh, welcome to boredom. <laughs> it's pouring around here. You bet there's nothing to do. Uh, uh, this isn't prep yet. Oh, if, man, if only I could complete this friggin' contract, that's where I'd be. Uh, you mentioned your contract. Well, I signed up to work for some scientists. Uh, I thought it would be easy. When I failed to notice that the contract only expires when all the work is done, the, uh, the scientists pro promised to give me the official permit to be in the zone at the end of it. Okay. Uh, I've completed every damn clause of the contract except for one thing. I have to find all the chemical artifacts in existence. Uh, uh, who would have known that you can't get meat chunks or cublogs around here? If I could get those two, I would have headed towards Pripyat a long time ago, but I can't. Might be able to help you with that. All right. Uh, new mission: Contract with scientists. Bring Gary the meat trunk and the Kobo back artifacts. Don't I have the one of them, the meat trunk? All right. Do you know the way to prep yet? I don't know, but it's full of artifacts. People say I'm ready to find one right now. Uh, so special about prep yet? No one knows how to get there. We're in the zone after all. You can't. You just can't walk straight there. It's a real treasure trove of artifacts. Either way. They've been so. There've been there, there've been many legends surrounding circulating for people that I'm playing curious. All right, so we gotta give him a meat chunk and something else. So that's no, I don't have a meat chunk. Oh no, but I got this one. I got the Kobolov thing one. So all we have to do is find him a meat chunk as well, and then and then I'm we have, do you we're done the quest with him. And there's another guy over here. Yes, Professor. You have my undivided attention. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I don't. Do you need help here? 
I forgive me this, but I refuse. Your equipment is simply unsuitable for intermittent side field. You'll meet a swift and painful death. And I don't need that on my conscious. Okay. Outside, need better equipment. Uh, what do you do here? You research various phenomenon. Okay. See you next time. How about oh. you? You need help Hello? with something. Um, there's already a stalker working for us, although, in theory, in fact, it's where of legend. Have you heard of the Oasis? No? Uh, many people talk about it, and it seems that nobody's ever seen it. It's like healing the waters. If you walk in, your wounds heal and your energy is replenished. There are many rumors making rounds, one more incredible than the next. Some claim they've seen it in their dreams. But as a scientist, I am obliged to ask, how do you know it was really the Oasis? If you look for it, well, I can't promise you a massive fee, but if the Oasis exists, the discovery would make a great stride in our research. Okay, I'll try and find it. Um, I'll see you later. Oh wait, can I can I sell things to this guy? No, just some guy. So I have an objective here. That's uh, what is the objective here? Okay, I just have to bring in the artifacts. I may have a meat chunk. I'm not sure. Okay, I can't sell this guy anything. All right, we're pretty good then. So two people that can possibly do repairs. We must wait for the doctor to become something. I I can't read that. All right, let's go next to over here. Stock cutter, you must holster your weapon. It prevents you from unholstering shooting some asshole in the face. Like that. Well, might as well just uh, start taking all the ammo from these guys. And alcohols. Whoops. I also wouldn't mind having that ammun ammunition from this gun, because that, that, that ammo is actually very useful. Oh, what the hell is this guy doing? Let's hold up a tick. Shit, I missed. Shit, I missed. Shit, I missed. Okay, now I don't even know why I missed that one. Oh my god, this guy is fucking so evasive. Yeah, let's just let's just actually like take time for a shot. Surprised that I don't have to unscope it every time I want to cycle the bolt. Oh my, what is this guy? Okay, finally, I almost met my match there. I sort of fucked. I was just being a fucking scrub lord. Alright, what's this gun? We got a assault rifle here. Uh, it's the shitty ass AKM. Fuck that thing. Fuck, I don't want your shit. What if this guy's like just taking a nap and I just took his weapon? Well, I just took all his ammunition. Oh, this is adorable. They fucking died on each other. It's almost romantic. Almost. Okay, I don't know where he came from, but thank God I'm a awesome sniper. Okay. Uh, there's nothing really over here. Let's just remove the health regeneration component of of this thing. That is the health regeneration component, correct? Yes. So we're just removing radiation passively. All right. So we have a building up there we can have a look at, as well as a little bit of a complex down here. Oh, this guy has the sweet shotgun. Oh man, I like his style. You can live. Actually, no, you're already dead, so you can't live. Okay, maybe we should have the shotgun. Actually, they don't really particularly care. Oh, found the weakness. They hate the sunlight. Why are these things so small? Where the fuck did this guy go? Oh no! 
<laughs> He's evolved and is allowed to go into the sunlight. I, I, I just want to say, I probably should have an actual assault rifle. Like, this is actually the worst shit ever. Okay, we have a keypad here. Code needed. Of course. Because, like, shooting those things on the floor is, like, like very difficult, too. this guy I want one of you assholes to have a veils detector so we have a couple of weapons in here and uh, that would appear to be an RPG so we have to find a way inside of here so there is a it cannot be open from this side so we have to find another way inside of here that's that is a question for today how do we get in there and I think I think we saw a hole in the roof did we not like just okay. I, I, I think there's. It's either from the basement or from a hole in the roof. Uh, is a there's a note. I'm hearing something. I don't want to read it quite yet because I'm hearing something. That was an AK. Another place over here. It's like I'm hearing footsteps, but whatever. Okay, let's see the note. Uh, an old sheet with the sentry duty schedule with the numbers 1421 underneath. Uh, it's a marker that reads, Lieutenant Slolikov, following the crash of the helicopter, I proceeded to evacuation point B205. No evacuation attempts uh, were made for two days. Remaining at this position is risky. I have therefore decided to leave B205 and proceed to the Scientific Ex Expeditions Mobile Laboratory. Uh, okay, this is allegedly where he went. Oh. Okay. Didn't realize I jumped into that. So, he was here. Like a shit stain. Okay, so I'm gonna guess that we actually do not go onto the top of this roof. Because I don't actually see a way of getting there. Gotta be a way in here. Like, how can this not be open from the side? Okay, I just want to see what's in there. Ah, see? There's a hole. Okay, so we go from the bottom. Nice, okay. So, I mean, there is an underground part of this place right here. So we can check out this first, assuming that there isn't like a hole over here somewhere. No. And in all likelihood. You know. Um, I'm gonna guess it's actually this place here. Oh, we entered the code. I guess we got the code from that reading thing. And this is a very nice looking passageway. Okay, no, it's not. Oh, there's a couple things there. I know how to handle that. The way we handle that is we simply don't. We handle this the, the Mike Lott stalker way. Yeah, we're it's because of the seaweed on the ceiling. We gotta crouch under some of it. All right, we can go this way. Uh, it doesn't look like there's anything that way, so we're gonna go out this way then. Let me through stalker. You know, I'm so glad I'm, I'm the best at dealing with situations like this. There is something here, isn't there?
Oh, it's your mother. Okay, so that was an extremely anticlimactic fight. Uh, I think also the burrs, are they? I was, you, dude, I was hearing it too, and I thought it was like something walking through the mud outside. What did it end up being? Is this thing spawned? It was just walking into a fucking crate. Thanks a lot, game. You know, for a game that has this much fucking atmosphere, it fucked that up so much. I, I started to remember what it was when I came over here, and then, because I, I, like I said, I, I hadn't played this in quite a while. And I, remember, and I was thinking, I was like, oh yeah, I think I beat something here. And it's just kind of walking into a fucking wall, so there was like no fight at all. It was just me shooting in the face a couple of times. Soccer is a la bug free game. Okay, I don't want to open the explosive box. Yeah, these things don't actually ever appear to have anything these days. Hey, guess what? We got a reward. It's right over here. Da 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 da. A lot of AKs. Oh shit. What the fuck are you doing alive? Fuck! Holy shit, you were evasive. Probably because I'm using the completely wrong weapon for this situation. And you see that? You see that amazing lock that this door had on it? <laughs> Which is basically nothing at all. Oh, dude, RPG time. And we got some pistols here. We got some more... Oh my god, I just fucking took everything. I mean, these are all really, like, excellent weapons. Uh, the AKs can just go screw themselves, though. What is this, AKS? What are these? H is AKs. Are they all the same uh, durability? Yeah, these are good. These, won't, these are shit and won't sell for anything, so... Just letting you guys know that. But we do have a rocket launcher now. So we have what I like to call the meme cannon. Oh, one sec. We need, we need, we need to eat some bread. I mean, how much fun do you think we're going to have with this? Probably not as much as you think. But we need to go and take all this crap back now, because uh, I'm actually pretty full on... I mean, dude, I'm carrying around an RPG now. And I'll be honest with you, there is no point in the game which this will become useful, pretty much. Medical supplies have been dropped in my my personal box and that Yeah, they keep doing that. Like, you never run out of health kits because they keep giving it to you because they're like they're super nice. But it's because they help someone at some point. Let's just have fun. Stalkers in for a while. Uh, okay, we're, we're not gonna do that anymore. I I had to try it at least once, but it as it turns out, it's a shitty weapon. Who would have thought? I like it slightly brighter today. So what else do we have here? We just have the pistols and. I mean, I could just sell this. This is probably gonna be worth like a little bit. But, you know, I'm kind of curious on what kind of upgrades you get. You know, let's just fucking eat the drugs. Even though we're so close. And I didn't eat my fucking energy drink either. Like, I, I don't really want an RPG. I won't lie. You know, I, I threw a grenade and the burr didn't react. It just occurred to me. The burr was like, fuck whatever, man. Uh, nitro's this way. Yeah, have a Sup. look. Sup indeed. Yeah, I can't even. I can't even do. I can't even fucking upgrade that. So it's a useless Later. piece of shit. We used it for a little bit, but it's probably worth like that much. So yeah, they can have that. You can have that too. You can also have all these pistols. And I think everything else is mine. I want that though. Oh, dude, look at this. This burrow hands. $800. Right there. Fucking premium. Burrow's hands. Yeah, we don't need that either. Okay, I think we're good here. 
I mean, there's some ammunition here that I should just drop, but whatever. See you. See you as well. Uh, but definitely before we go, we're gonna actually go see if we can talk to that guy again. Do I actually need all this ammo? The answer is probably not, but... Here we are doing this anyways. Alright, let's just eat a shit ton of bread. Delicious. Absolutely delicious. Hey, stalker. How are you? Alright, let's go, let's go talk to the guy. You gotta ask him what the fuck, why the fuck he was at the the the, the, the crash site or whatever. I mean, I'm so glad they set up an outpost here when there's like a perfectly good other outpost there. Probably better defended. Air t oh, I have to wait for the air. T it has to be airtight. The airlock. I see. Hey. Hey, well, uh, bro. I found your note at Valkov H A A. Take it. Oh, listen. Oh, never mind. I don't think if any of our people will show up in this location, anyways. If you spot military around here, let me know in advance. We got an army med kit for that. Really? That's it. Howdy, just... cool. Good luck. I'm listening. I took away the stuff, and then he's just like, "Yeah, whatever." Okay, so he will not upgrade the shotgun, but he can upgrade. He can he can upgrade air armor though. Needs additional information. What information do you need? I guess you don't need any information. So he will upgrade my armor for me. Fucking close the door. Thanks, asshole. Alright, where are we gonna go now? Well, that's a question for another time, because uh, we want a free mate. But, uh, we are running probably... Actually, we're just fine. I can keep going. I was gonna say we're running over time, but I think we're okay. Yeah, well, that's the... That's that bullshit anomaly or whatever. So, we got a free Private Mate. Is that actually how we say his name? Pretty sure it's not. Okay, it is Mate. Totally is Mate. And nobody's gonna tell me otherwise. There's a truck here, but I'm probably gonna stay away from that. Fuck are these guys? You know, one good grenade can deal with all these guys. Yeah, but they're all my they're all, all my friends. Are these guys duty or freedom? That's the question. Stalker, could you come over we here? Sit around here all day, but that won't get us anywhere. Hello, Stalker. Could you help us? What happened? Uh, I don't remember. The first thing we we don't remember how we got here. Remember, there's a the monolith squad, and we have this burning desire to reach the center of the zone. That's where the monolith is. It's a meteor. And that brought the beginnings of a new life form from other planets. I remember reaching the C CNPP together, and it's all fragmented. I remember a bright light, cosmic cold, and a clear voice. Everything was just perfect. I don't remember what the There's voice ordered me to do now. So the years of my life is gone. The boys are the same. We don't know what to do. We definitely need somewhere to take cover from the initians. It means, right? No ideas where we'd be safe. There's a stalker base not far from here. I can point it to you on a map. I'm not sure that's safe. We were on our way for a CMPP, we were treated we with suspicion. I, I think Whatever we actually killed stalkers afterwards. Do you know how our people could treat uh, our faction right now? They'll probably start shooting. Can you help us? Can we you can tell everyone at the stalker camp we're not killers day. anymore? Can but you speak to them and get them anywhere. to accept us? Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll speak to them next time I'm at the base. So this is Monolith. This is from first game. And so this is kind of what happened after the brain scorcher and shit got turned off. Uh, they're kind of here and then they're like, oh, I think everyone wants like, doesn't like us now, so. Just whatever. Alright, so we gotta go rescue this guy. Oh. Let's just, uh... Let's just turkey shoot this. Pretty sure someone's trying to throw a grenade at me. Oh, you motherfucker. I, I came very well equipped for this. Oh, you want some too, huh? <laughs> I'm I'm stealthing this right now. Who's trying to shoot me? Are you trying to shoot me over here?
Yeah. I mean, the... This is why... Snipers were a little harder to find in the default game, mostly because you could just do this. Like, who the fuck deals with snipers like this? The AI just can't handle it, so... This is why I kind of when I saw this, and I'm like, yeah, I don't think it's going to be a problem. I mean, there's a lot of ways you can deal with this, but... Some move his legs. Okay, we got a free mate. I mean, I'm now kind of with them now. Oh, dude, this guy's a sawed-off one. What a guy. Like, just yelling something incoherently at me. In German or whatever language they speak. Okay, maybe there's a couple more here than I anticipated. I'm hearing them run around. A little bit worried about just kind of jumping out in the middle of nowhere, so. But unfortunately, we do have to. Oh shit. He's right here. Oh, this guy's got like the, the nice ass shotgun, too. I just like this hunting one so much. Probably start. I, I can hear one over there. Oh. Fucking hell. You know, I, I just tried this night vision out, and it's actually pretty good, except it flickers really badly in the storm. But this is actually helping me see better than it would be otherwise. Except for this. The fucking lightning is just blinding. Shit. Fuck! This guy's like suppressing firing me. All right, well, we'll head back in now. I think I got most of them again. Dude, we got like a sawed off here and a oh shit. Good thing he yelled at me in Russian before uh, he decided to kill me. The weapon's nice though, but it's not always the best. But the, it like it 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 does like two extremes. It's, it makes everything either too easy or like it's just like just useless for certain situations. However, that actually just makes it kind of a good weapon, doesn't it? Doesn't it overall? You know? Have to take a shotgun? Apparently not. So there's six people here, or something. That's why I think that six on the side means. I forgot how the stalker UI works with this kind of stuff, but yeah. Oh, fucking hell, dude. How do these guys make absolutely no noise? Okay, that guy just went flying. Alright, it's four left. Probably not gonna loot this guy now. Yeah, let's take all that.
Maybe we'll use the actual flashlight now. Of course, night vision doesn't work in the when I have the scope on. That's why finding a nice sight. Shit. Alright. I can't even fucking see this guy. Okay, I think I hit him. I like to assume I did. I, I wish I could hear this guy's heavy ass breathing, but I think the lightning is masking it. We'll just kind of loot some other people while we're at it. Okay, so we got three left. Oh, wait, this guy's like a, a different shotgun now. Oh, uh, this is just the Mossberg. Fuck that. That thing's a piece of shit. Okay, this is, would not be the way forward. It's not this way either, so we need to find the way into the compound. It might be like somewhere over here. Alright, I'm highly suspicious of this area. On your knees, show me those hands. God damn it. That's what I mean, the, sni the sniper is actually not good for that. I was thinking I could just pick someone off, but no. Alas, no. It's probably why I shouldn't bring the sniper and a shotgun, you know? It's either assault rifle and shotgun, or sniper and uh, other thing. Although, this thing is actually not that bad for this kind of situation. Oh, those don't actually blow up. I forgot, this isn't your typical video game logic where um, just because it's red doesn't mean it blows up. Okay. You didn't notice I went the other way. I pulled the good old Mike Lap maneuver on him. Hostage rescued. Thanks for saving me. Hey, you peace out. What kind of gun did he have? Man, I thought this was going to be the end of me. Wow, you took out all these bandits on your own. You the man. They won't believe me when I tell this story. Can I get out of here now? Yeah, sure. Anything else here? He, he, dude, he thought I was the man. Nobody ever thinks I'm the man. Just in case you're wondering, you can do this one by uh, like having everybody kind of like, you can have them help you out. But I basically told the guy, I'm like, yeah, uh, yeah I'll fucking do it on my own. Actually, wait, this is the gun, I think. Ooh, dude, we got the Desert Eagle. That's a staple, guys. Dude, we gotta have the Desert Eagle. Uses the 50 AEF full metal jacket. Yeah, we don't want this fucking garbage. Fuck that. Dude, Desert Eagle is where it's at. Alright. I'll meet you. I'll meet you by the old train station. My friends will definitely reward you when we get back. Uh, we could go back to base together. Uh, I don't know. I'll, I'll drop by later, because I have, um... Actually, I probably should have had him help come. Okay, fine, let's go. Oh, we did it. We got back. Let's go see what the, our reward is for doing this. <laughs> it's just, he points a shotgun at his friend. It's like, you motherfucker. Alright. Uh, thanks for freeing me. Tell me how you got captured. Don't ask. It's my own fault. <laughs> Bandits warned me about it, uh, but they started demanding a share of the loot. The zone didn't belong to nobody, so why should I pay them? Uh, me and my boys were going to tell them to shove it. 
It seemed like it could pretty, uh, it seems like we got away with it. Uh, but the bandits turned up to turned out to be pretty crafty. They set up an ambush. And they jumped him. Alright. I just managed to uh I just managed to convince them, man. I got <laughs> How did I manage to convince them? To fucking... Whatever. Uh, thanks for getting me today out. You're a beast taking on all those bandits by yourself. Here, take this as a um, token of grat uh, gratitude. Give me goldfish and some stash coordinates. I just see like a pro like you. Howdy. This guy has nothing. So we can now carry around like Desert Eagle just for, just for shits and giggles. The ultimate hand cannon. It's designed for hunting medium sized and large game. It's fucking Desert Eagle. Go figure. Alright, goldfish. Radiation. Maximum weight plus 12. Kind of nice. But we don't have enough to, to handle that. But we got a nice artifact out of that. Very nice. So, what else can we do with them? Um, what, what do you guys think? What kind of speed upgrades can we have with the. We're gonna use this thing. A group of peaceful monolith fighters seeking refuge who can help them. Are you serious? I heard they're animals. Well, stalkers won't give them a time of day, that's for sure. You should probably speak to Shoga. The lieutenant colonel lets them join duty, they'll be safe. So this is a matter of what... Do I want them to join duty or freedom? And the answer is probably the one I want them to be on my side of. So here we go. We can, like, have, like, um... An increased mag side. Like, let's, let's fucking deck this out. This is, like, uh, accuracy plus 10%. Lower the weight of the gun. Muzzle velocity and fire rate. That's kind of nice. So we can actually do something like have, we can have like the the pistol and maybe just the sniper on the side. Because I think having the pistol would be, like having a pistol would be good for me. Because how much does this weigh? It weighs like, like almost nothing. Like weighs like one kilogram. So I, I, I did want to, I did want to have a pistol. I just didn't know which one. That's actually really fucking awesome. I like how I run with the pistol man, by the way. It's so derpy. Alright, you got any work for me? No, just the tunnels. Alright, how much... Do we have ammo for this guy still? No, we don't. I may have sold it. It's actually the saddest thing... Saddest story of my life, but I may have done that. It was, it was before I came here. I sold a bunch of ammo, which I didn't think I needed. And I wasn't quite thinking about the fact that I would maybe get Desert Eagle at some point. For some reason, I just kind of didn't think about that. Let's run, let's do the derpy animation with, let, let's see if this guy has some ammo. Uh, let's see here. I want to sell these sausages though. And it's bread. Alright, let's see, do you have pistol ammo for this? No, you really don't, do you? Hello. That is the saddest fucking story of my life. What new? Yeah, this would be, this would be duty. Duty can go fuck itself. We're about America, we're about freedom. How about you? Hey, man. Uh, I've met a group of fighters that want to join Freedom. Well, we're always open to good people. They're welcome to join us if they're up for it. It's a small problem. They're former monolith fighters. A small problem. I see. I prefer to see monolith fighters at, through my scope. Anything else is out of the question. These ones are peaceful. It looks like they were under someone else's control because they don't remember how it happened and after they lay off CNPP, they, they simply don't know what to do now. So I'm a bit skeptical. Or what if you're lying to me on purpose? Um... Okay, he won't let them join. Good luck. What a dickhead. I don't know what to do with that. I'll figure it out next time, so... Um... I mean, uh, yeah, we'll just, we'll just go, so... Uh, maybe not go, because it's, like, dark, so... Let's go when it's daytime. We're gonna sleep on this fucking lopsided mattress, alright. Where are they putting the medical supplies? I guess they're in here. I'll just put a bunch in, in, in there. And then also this jellyfish thing or whatever the fuck it is. Alright guys, that's all the time I think that we have for today. So tomorrow, uh, we'll probably continue, so... It's still a bit dark, but don't worry, I'll light up real fast. So bye everyone. Take care.